it's a work in progress. So if you haven't heard, this Gen 4 is right around the corner. And if history is any indicator, it's projected to be pretty exciting for both participants and viewers and spectators alike. Oh my God. Oh. So with that coming up on the 3rd of June, and because I have a whole trove of footage from last year's Just Jam that I never got to use and it's just sitting on my hard drive without an edit to identify with, I thought I'd make a little recap. I didn't actually participate in Disc Jam last year due to me breaking my bottom beforehand or some bollocks, but I was able to film a little bit of the front and back end of the jam. I couldn't film the middle end because I was at work. That's, that's fun. That alone was a really fun time, just watching people throw down and give it their best from afar. Uh, that alone should be enough of a promo to get you hyped for what's to come this year. I did go back and try some of the challenges myself about a month later after my butt had healed, uh, just by myself without any of the pressure of getting my ass whooped during a competition weighing over my head, which you'll find out in a little bit I, I very much needed. So I'll throw that in as well. That was a really fun time. Hit flexor pain following the art museum tack challenge not included. Also, I was completely absent for day two, which was when all the finalists threw down. I feel really bad about that. Just know that it was really hype and all the competitors were amazing. And congrats to you guys if you're watching. Yeah, that's about it. I'll just be observing you, observing this. So for those of you who haven't been following me, I was injured for Disc Jam 3 this year. It was freaking tragedy. Really upset about it. But I decided last minute today to try and knock out as many challenges as I could from that day. Because why not? It's nice. It's 70 out. And I don't know how much longer I have until it rains. So I think I'll go ahead and do it now and pray that I don't... Uh, screw myself up before winter training starts, so let's have some fun. Good afternoon, Austin Sonic Boom Promo Scott here. Thankfully, there are enough leggy challenges from this jam that I can still work on, so I'm gonna give a couple of those a shot. <laughs>
that was that. I still have the 180 and the vault over the rail to pre to get done, but that's for another day. Um, that tack was the absolute worst challenge I've ever attempted, and I don't want to ever do it again, but I probably will just to rep tacks because I don't do enough tacks, and that's the reason why it sucked. So it's a weird cycle how that works. I wanted to get more done in a single day, but it's not the competition and I want to try and get as many challenges as I can. So I don't want to injure myself either. So I'll take care and see you in one jump cut. Bye bye. Uh, uh, no, I'm gonna do the shirt. It's becoming clear and clear to me that that comp would have completely destroyed me if I had actually participated. Not gonna lie. Really humbling, but it just means I got more room to improve. Look forward to it. So, moving on.